So I don't care. If, if people don't believe me, girl, you don't believe me. Um, I have millions of people out there that know I'm a real ass bitch, that know I'm always honest, and that know that no one's gonna pay me, honey. What's going on, everyone? It's Rich Lux. In today's video, girl, you won't believe the in less than 62 hours and more drama has unfolded the house girl jeffree star went on a massive snapchat rant addressing the morphe foundations and how he said he was gonna review it himself on a live video you already know i have my fat ass opinions and i have all the receipts oh check out this bag i bought look at that isn't it so like this color pattern is amazing here's how i feel about the whole situation i don't think jeffree star has really reviewed a morphe product that i can even remember and i find it so like weird that now people are like jeffree you need to review you need to review you need to review it and i'm like oh, girl why now do people feel like he should review this one product? He didn't review the Jaclyn Hill palette, did he? He didn't review the James Charles palette. He didn't review the Bretman Rock palette. You get what I'm trying to say? But now people are like, you need to review this. So let me roll you the clip, guys. Here you go. Hey, how are ya? Um, just getting home here in beautiful LA. It's so rainy and gloomy. I'm feeling like a little Louis Vuitton riding hood right now. <laughs> um, but... All right, so tomorrow I want to talk about the live stream that I'm going to be doing. I'm really excited. Now you guys know. Listen, there's been some tea today. Everyone in the makeup community is talking. People are shook. People are making up lies. People are doing some crazy shit. And everyone is talking about the Morphe Foundation. Um, now, of course, I get dragged into it. Girl, let's drag me in, bitch. Let's talk about it. So a lot of people are like, Jeffrey, are you going to review it? And I'm sitting there like, um, you know, I, I'm out of town. Everyone else has been reviewing it. Alyssa Ashley did a review. Um, some people that I don't really did a review. And I've seen so many people, like, talk about it. But I haven't seen anyone that I really trust, like a Tati, um, Miss Tati Westbrook. Miss Tati Westbrook, you need to get on your channel, girl, and review it. Ooh, girl, this hair. Um, so I haven't seen anyone that I, like, fully trust, um, review it right so i'm like okay y'all want me to review it great but I, i've been out of town so i literally just got back from michigan and i'm like people online have been trying to come for me today and i think it's hilarious because look back at how many morphe launches launches excuse me how many morphe brushes launches in 2018 did i review Girl, I didn't even review James's palette. I used it for the first time on his channel. Um, you guys know, when I'm doing my own makeup at home, I love my own eyeshadow palettes. Bitch, have you tried the formula? It's sickening. I don't really use that many other brands when I'm just sitting at home. Do I review a lot of shit? Of course, but I review hot topics, things that you guys want to see and what I get requests on. Um... And you guys don't beg me to review Morphe. There's so many people online that review it that have codes that you guys... Um, Snapchat, don't cut me off. But there's so many people that have codes and, you know, y'all know what it is. I've never had a code with anyone except someone for charity. So um, I don't really review Morphe on my channel. But a lot of you are like, Jeffrey, you have to try it out. Um, this person said it was this. This person said it was this. And I'm like, when I first started, I was like, damn, 60 shades that is amazing we should be celebrating that but if the formula is weird or there's something wrong with it girl let's talk about it let's let's expose it let's spill the tea um but i haven't tried it yet so tomorrow um at noon pacific standard time 3 p.m um eastern standard time i'm gonna be going on twitch and instagram my personal instagram live i'm gonna go live on two different apps um and i'm just gonna show it raw unedited you guys can ask me questions um i'm also gonna have a few friends over and they're gonna help me and they're gonna try it out as well um, so you're gonna have a little surprise because i'm gonna bring over a few friends um and they're gonna help me investigate and see what is going on um now here's the deal you guys i just got back i don't have to fucking review it at all there's people really trying to come for me on twitter today i'm like girl girl relax now is Jeffree Star Cosmetics in Morphe brushes? 
Y'all know it is. Um, and hi, y'all. I fully support it, but I don't give a fuck who it is. My grandma can make a lipstick, and if the shit was awful, I'd be like, girl, <laughs> go in my lab. Um, so I don't care. If, if people don't believe me, girl, you don't believe me. Um, I have millions of people out there that know I'm a real ass bitch, that know I'm always honest, and that know that no one's gonna pay me, honey. No one writes my checks but myself. Um, so tomorrow, we're have some fun we're gonna log on to instagram we're gonna log on to my twitch account and we're gonna live stream this me and some friends are gonna try it on and see what the real tea is um and then we're gonna go back to reality because that's what the fuck we're gonna do and i have so many new youtube videos coming for you guys i'm gonna test that skin changing color changing foundation i've been seeing all over the internet um what else do we have we have the new fenty beauty concealers um i got it so highly requested now when i get some that is like every day like girl i'll try it yeah i got you um there's also so many new drugstore stuff from physicians formula um the lonnie i bought a lot of stuff while i was um, gone on the weekend so hopefully over the next few days i'll be getting a lot of packages and i'm gonna be filming up a storm also i'm gonna do a video at tj maxx later this week Mm-hmm, bitch, ready for that one? Miss TJ Maxx. I'm also going to be doing a little ASMR comeback. It's been a few months, girl, so... I feel that... Okay, the videos that have been going up reviewing the foundation have not been so stellar, okay? I kind of feel like the only way you can really tell if it's good is if you try it for yourself. Like, I've never been in a store and somebody's been like, Oh, sir, have you tried this? And I'm like, oh, no. Tati Westbrook said, that's horrible. I'm not going to try it. No, I, want, I still want to try it for myself. You know, I've never been at a store and told somebody that, oh, no, Jeffree Star was horrible. Oh, no, no, no. You know what I'm saying? I feel like this whole Morphe situation, people just bring it down a couple notches. Just because your favorite YouTuber might have said it was crap or Maya said it was good, just still try for yourself. Because let me tell you guys, there has been times when beauty gurus have said something was amazing. This $200 primer that I still use every now and then, it's all right. I bought it because an influencer on YouTube, a mega famous YouTuber, I think it was Jaclyn Hill or Tati, one of them, they said that they, no, it was to, it was Jaclyn Hill. They said that they use this all the time. And it's a primer, a $200 primer. I used it. It was okay. But I don't think it was the best primer. Oh, speak it. Oh, let me show you what I got at the store. Okay. Okay. I ran out. So I rebought it. Is This is like one of the things from Chanel that I rebuy all the time when I run out. And it's really basic. I think it's like $45, $50. This is the packaging right here. There's another one that's like a squishy, kind of like soft one. But this one is, to me, I like it. But then again, you may not like it for yourself type of thing. Okay, so this was it. This is the Chanel face wash. And I'll be generous enough to show it to you. Okay, so check this out. So here's what it looks like. There it goes. Okay. So it looks white and it smells like the uh, Hydra Beauty. And you just rub it in like that. And it's gonna lather up a little bit and it is a face wash. And I use it in the mornings and at night. Not all the time, some, cause I just can't remember sometimes. And it's the Cleansing Milk by Chanel. And it says Le Liat right there, boom. That's the one I use. I've been using it for a while. I love the way it smells and I just like how it makes me feel and I like it. Now, just because I like it, you may not like it. And it's the same thing with this Morphe stuff. That works for me. The Morphe foundation may work for me. It may not. I'm waiting to buy it. I don't care if Jeffrey reviews it, Tati reviews I don't care. I walk. But I want to try it for myself at the end of the day and see how it really works out. And if it's crap, it's crap. And that's the one thing. I don't think Jeffrey owes any anyone or anything a positive or negative review. If he likes it, he likes it. If he doesn't, he doesn't. And I know I'll get thrown to the wolves. Well, really? How dare you? You should hate Morphe just like everybody else. Girl, I can care less. Morphe don't pay my bills. I don't have an affiliate link, but just because of that, I'm not gonna bash them or anything. If the product is good, the product is good. And I think I remember Steve Jobs said this. People vote with their wallets. Me and you, we vote with our wallet. All these videos and people, blah, 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 that, that doesn't matter, okay? 
if the product is good, people are going to buy it. And if the product is horrible, no one will buy it and Morphe will be forced to take it off the shelves. That's just the truth all day long and then reformulate it. Um, regardless of negative attention or positive attention or press or whatever, if the product is good, people will spend their own hard earned money on it. People are willing to spend their money on it to keep it alive and keep it coming. That's all I gotta say about that. Let me know how you feel about all that drama in the comments down below. If you like the video, smash that like button, comment, rate, subscribe. It helps me out so much. If you don't like the video, send it to your haters so when they watch it, they lost 10 minutes of their life to never get back. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye, I love you so much.